guys and good evening ulit sa inyo lahat and welcome back to group stage number 1 of Dream League Season 20 Second series na rin to for tonight This oh, game number 1 between Team Master and Shopify Rebellion So uh, kaya na naman natin itong 2 teams sa to For Team Master you do have to mail and it's up against his old teammate and dyan si RTZ sa Shopify So uh, ngayon lang sila ulit magkikita magkakalaban at tignan natin what will happen for this game number 1 Looking at the current standings Shopify P5 US car nila Three wins, five loss. Meanwhile, Team Master four four new score nila. So um, medyo dikit lang naman. Yung mga score nila sa so, so, tignan natin what will happen between these two teams. So for the side of Team Master, you have Doom and Anti Mage, and for Shopify, it's gonna be Medusa and Undying. So nakita na natin agad yung instant counter on the Medusa. We already had these two core heroes pick out for Team Master. So you parang hindi mo na problema here, dito agad yung Medusa. Left. They have a lot of ways to catch yeah, him. You have to, you have now. the anti mage with the mana burn. Though hindi ko nga lang alam kung anong item build yung galang yung anti mage. Kasi may mga nakikita kong uh, anti mage player na nagdipi sa blade pa din. Kapag ka meron silang kalaban na medusa. Well, uh, for Shopify, they will go for the shadow demon support. Well, you need someone to save down your medusa. You had the soul repeal from undying. You had the disruption from uh, SD. Pwede mo rin copyin yung ano eh. Uh, 10 seconds to pick Pwede mo rin copyin yung anti-mage sa totoo lang para at least meron din kayong mana burn up against your enemy. Pero depende kung anong mangyayari sa team fights. Pero yung 2 supports na meron tayo dito for Shopify is para sila walang disable. Ay. Yeah, para sila walang disable. More on saving yung parang gusto nila nang mangyari on these two type of heroes. So for team master, they just need to get a hero na kaya nito malon on the back lines. Cash your support. Spirit Heroes, open pa naman yung Ember. Ito na lang pa yung natitra within the Spirit Heroes. Or maybe someone else na kaya tumalon on the back lines. Kasi wala talaga tayo nakikita ang any disables for Shopify. The only, ha the only disable they have is yung Stone Gaze ng Medusa. So parang wala pang threat dito on the anti-major whatsoever. And Team Master might be the best time to go for their support heroes. Radiant team pick! Enchantress! So it's gonna be the Enchantress for Team Aster. One of the heroes that can easily win out the lane. And then you enchant, just get a creep. Win out the lane of your anti mage, or if ever mana pause for to. Pwede nila maparusan agad early on yung, yung uh, Medusa. Oh, Rick, there's only 10 seconds left to pick a hero! Parang for Team Aster, mas better if kukuwa sila ng Rage of Sports since they're leaning up against and dying. Come on, tired team, pick it, pick it good. Well, it's gonna be the snap for pick for Team Aster, so um, di ko sure ko ano magi roll nito. Possible mid if they want. Snap fire is a universal hero. Does have a lot of damage. Also, way to save someone. Kung magi build up man siya na ano scepter. You got ten seconds left. Or actually, they pick um, the snap fire to counter out ten dying. No, that's easy ko. So you can easily destroy the tombstone, wala rin kasi kayong heroes for answer na kayo simira ng tomb. So, you do have the snapfire. Andiyan na yung answer. May answer sila sa Medusa, may answer na sila sa Undying. So we're just waiting out this fourth pick for uh, Shopify. So any other years now, oh, it'll hatch out to use of Team Master. Kailan talaga nila ng solid disable for this game. Someone that goes well together with Medusa as well. 
meron kayong stone gaze pero wala kayong kahit anong disable to hold down yung enemy heroes para at least diba mag-connect yung uh, stone form or whatsoever. By the way guys, have a ongoing game between Team Master and Shopify. Nakalive ngayon si Paul ng game ng, ga ng uh, Gaming Gladiators versus Entity. So, mapaala na kayo kung anong gusto nyo yung series na panoorin. Radiant Team Band! Well, it's gonna be the Axe Fort pick for Shopify so that they may answer nila up against the Anti-Mage. It's actually a good hero. Hindi ka naman ganun kamana dependent. Ang damage from OCs nang gagaling dun sa counter helix. So, as is a good hero for Shopify, nakaran na rin tayo ng uh, really disable. Kaya to pa, no? So, Shopify, they're just looking for their last pick mid hero and for team master. Hindi ko sure. Kung ano hinagin, I think mid hero din yata. Oh, dire team ban. Oh man, Rick, there's only 10 seconds left to pick a hero! Yeah, 5 seconds left now. So, Pac will be banned out. Ano pa ba ang natitirang hero dito ni Mirahel? MK will be banned out for the side of Shopify. Hmm. Kasi pwede rin kasi nila ilagay sa medyo anti-mage eh, no? Parang ang dami mong pwede gawin on this hero. May gumawa nga na teammating talent esports yata yung gumawa na anti-mage offlane. Two times nila ginawa yun. Uh, 10 seconds to pick your hero, you moron. Um, you, you Parang inisip ng Shopify is kukuha na lang ng hero yung team master na kaya maka-survive ng axe lane. Maybe a range hero na hindi pwedeng na hindi kaya ang lapitan ng axe. But anyway, Finrage is gonna be the last man for team master. Shopify, they have the advantage. They have the last pick. Pero, going for the last man. Parang yung mga malilikit na hero yata yung halana ng sanggalin eh, no? You, you really gotta pick a hero. You got 10 seconds left. Aside from Ember, I think my universal hero is yeah, not in the time. You can see it Sumil. Now. Then you tinker, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Wala pa naman pang huli yung Shopify, but it's gonna be the Faces Void, last ban for Shopify and for Team Aster. Wala na silang masyadong oras, they only have 17 seconds left on their reserve time. So yun na lang yung manaykita kong uso sa mid. Or uh, what if they can still go for mid snapfire pa rin naman if they want. Uh, ten seconds Just to get another hero, support you... hero. Moron. Five seconds, Morty. It'll be fine. Well, 10 seconds left for Team Aster. Kailangan nila ng hero na kayong gumala on the map. Masyadong mabagal yung timing na Anthony. Team team goes for the Doom, but they will go for the Venomancer last pick. So, anong mid nila dito? I think Snapfire mid yata to. This might be Snapfire mid and a Venomancer support. Maybe post 5 Venomancer. Yun yung ayaw nung action na slow down siya. Oh man, Rick, there's only 10 seconds left to pick a hero! So, uh, Universal didn't even see Venomans here, just big little game medium Venom. I'm not sure. But we had the Universal heroes for a team master. Meanwhile, Shopify just looking for the last pick mid. ES na baton ni Mirahel ulet. Never mind, it's gonna be that Invoker of Mirahel. He is one of, I mean, that's one of his best heroes. So, snap for mid. Yung uh, gaga winito ng team master. So, right click type to, that's one thing for sure. Maybe ito si may first item niya being Universal hero. Mas better na talaga yung ganung approach on the Snapfire. Instead of going for that aura items and that invoker last week for Shopify, is it gonna be enough? When you're up against Anti Mage, dyan yung uh, mine avoid on the Medusa, mine avoid on the invoker, you're up against three intelligence heroes. So I'm really not sure about this invoker last week. Pero dito natin ano mga yara sa leaning face. Parang for me kasi Aster. They have answer on every heroes for the side of Shopify for uh, Shopify Rebellion. And I might be wrong. 
Depende kung gaano ka-active yung Shopify for this game, which is, yun yung kailangan nilang gawin. They're up against anti-mage. Hindi nila pwedeng patagalin masyado yung laro, even though you have Medusa. Magiging problema mo talaga dito is yung mana void from the anti-mage. Nasa na po si Abed? Uh, Shopify pa rin naman siya, kaso saan siya ng visa issues, so pinalitan siya kayo ni Mirahel. Si Mikey kasi busy eh. Division to ngayon ng, ano, ng Western Europe, so I think si Mirahal na lang yata yung naisip na ng option na pwede nilang hunin under mid. She's Rick Merritt, some real trouble. I know, Morty. Just follow my lead. Arigato. Arigato. Alright, Morty, the game's about to start. Well, looking at the bounty rate, it's going to be a 2 for 2 trade-off. We don't see any earlier aggression or any attempts for that early first blood. So, back to their respective lanes. Well, middle lane, it's going to be not far up against uh, Invoker. Usually, it's going to be not far up against Invoker. It's going to be not far up against Invoker. It's going to be not far up against Invoker. I think it's okay lang naman itong, uh, nangyari sa kanya ngayon. And you can just spam out your Rifix up against Invoker. Sobrang annoying ng Scatter Blast. It has a lot of damage and it's still slow. May attack speed slow din ba ito? Ah, meron din. So, well, lumalimang naman 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 <laughs> Lumalimang naman right now in terms of last year, it's the build up against that invoker Pinaganda ko sa talaga yung snapper ngayon, you know, tumas yung damage Reverse on shower, it's gonna go for that cookie, body block, scatter blast, it's still on cooldown for 7 seconds so there's no way na kaya niyang patayin si Mirakyle but he's just continuously harassing him out of his lane. Mirakyle still needs to be careful. Scatter Blast damage is there. So every time na meron spell dito si Mirakyle is just gonna use it every time. Meron na rin naman na siyang battle which is already on the way. Well, crit with rotation gets the Courier of Sumail, pero nakuha naman yung bottle niya, so yun naman yung mahalaga. Water Dune will be given to Mirakel. Nice on the rotation on the Shadow Demon.
So, hanggang sa ngayon, wala pa rin naman tayo nakikita ang first blood looking nice at the last hit na malamang dito si Samil up against Saint Booker. In 18, last hit and 16, nice. Mirahal dito siya makahinga dito sa middle lane. Meanwhile, side lane, sell RTC, farming on the top lane. Later on, dito may hirapan si Muli. Pagka nagkaroon na tayo ng enough levels on the axe or maybe his vanguard. Parang yun na yung mga time na hindi na kaya ang lumi ng anti-mage. Radiant just fortified their structures. You know what I'm talking about? So yung mid pa rin yung pinapanood natin sa ngayon eh, no? Or there goes the first blood at the bottom lane. Mamamatay dito si sa IMS Cat. And the first blood goes in the hands of Grit. So hindi natin nakita kung ano yung nangyari. Pagkat raskado, I smart real boy, si Mami. Hindi mo na natin siya nag-isilis. Hiyaw ko ba dito sa camera man na to? So ngayon ko lang din napansin na si XSS pala yung tumapat dito sa Axe. Hindi kasi tinignan ng camera yung silence, hindi ko rin naman napansin yung color code nila. So, hindi pa nila ng lane dito yung animation, I think that's better. Kasi hindi mo talaga kaya yung axe. So, at least for the Doom, you can easily clear out the creeper with your Scorch Earth. So, for jungle after that one. So, um, for Monet, kailangan nyo rin mag-tail sa top lane, stop against Medusa and Undying. I do have a Voga to help him out. And then there's the creep with mana burn. So, pure mana burn. Talaga, yung meron yung heroes nila sa ngayon. So, Fly can go to spam out his DK Vel. That's how the two men goes. Parang ngayon is being pushed back by the Voga with his Imperus as well. When he damaged, Mango will be used finally. Okay. On to the Voga. Drops the two stone. They have to guard Kiri. Pero Monet goes for the blinking. No more mana for RTC. Has the one. And makukuha pa rin naman ni Simon Scott yung kill. The K connects onto two heroes. Pero that's it for Fly. Doesn't have any mana left. And Sunstrike. Not gonna be able to make it onto the Venomancer. So, luwa na tayo. And Monet. Medyo nakakabawi naman siya sa ngayon. Ngayon na nahihirapan siya sa lane. Pero good rotation. On the Venomancer. Doesn't need to stay at the bottom lane. Wala rin naman siyang gagawin. Together with two. I think it would be better if we secure nyo na lang yung lane ng Anthem Mage. Mahirapan nyo yung Medusa. This early on. It's better this way. Well, the Boca with rotation, Miracle, might be in trouble, they had the cookie for the stun, and that more to more skis is the shop, he's gonna be there from crit, but it's way too late, mag-coconnect pa rin naman yung last cookie, yung last more to more skis from Snapfire, and still gonna get that power rune, it's gonna be the evolution rune onto Sumail, so it's my shot, wait till it's spell out that gold snap later on. Well, top lane, RTZ might be in trouble again. Now, it doesn't have any mana, but I think they just want to go for a fly. Masyado na rin malay dito si RTZ. So, Monet with the right clicks. There's nothing left for the anti-mage. Sun Strike will not hit. Monet knows na meron Sun Strike dun. Game sense na lang yung mga ganyan. Pero, Saber Knight with the kill on the bottom lane. It's on to Siamese Cat. Not sure bakit ganun siya kalalim. Pero, Vanguard is already up for the axe. There's no way that you can take down this hero. Same goes for the anti-mage. Meron na rin Vanguard si Muni. Sorry. A rotation from the supports, Miracle might be in trouble, but it's 3v3 at the middle lane. Lucian will be used, Doomstone will be dropped, and Simon's Cat 
will be taken down to Sharky for the save on to Miracle and Smiles is trying to farm this tombstone but will be denied by Fly. Mortimer's Kisses is still on cooldown for him for 3 seconds and he doesn't have any mana but still has it to take charges. He can still try if he wants. And a Mortimer's Kisses will be dropped. Does he have the aim to take down Miracle? They had the detection, they had the sentry and right, another kill but this time attack. we're going to the hands of Aboha. Hi Kia, Mel Lacerna, hello. <laughs> Grabe. This is how I help you get better. Hi, right, we're gonna have the boss pero 3k goalie na tayo right now for uh, Team Master. Sobrang ganda na nangyari sa kanila for this game. You have free lane on your Doom, free lane on your Snapfire, singles for uh, anti-mage. Ganang katasa yung last hits niya, pero nakakuha siya ng kill. Na-slow down nila yung uh, farm. Dito nung Medusa. Well, mana void will be used now. We don't have any mana onto the Medusa. Right takes from Monet and RTZ. Just gonna fall again. And Miracle. Meron pa rin tayong send. He still have detection. And Miracle will finally show himself. Pero mana void is on cooldown. Link is on cooldown as well. For Monet's Sunstrike. Masyadong malayo yan on the Venomancer. So, Sumail will take down crit on the other side. Hindi ko na alam ano nangyayari ito for Shopify sa ngayon. Parang... Yan ito yung laro ng OG, ano, na may axe sila. Mukhang si Saber, like, yata yung kailangan mag-step up dito for uh, Shopify. Well, they had the disruption, they had the setup, and now call will be used by Saber Light. So, next on to the anti-mage, they had the Sunstrike, pero yung damage, hindi ganun siya kasakit. This is gonna go for the TPL, we had the tornado for the cancel, and mukhang mabibigyan yata ng tuloy. That's a Kalim Blade and a good setup for Shopify. So finally, nakabawi na rin sila dito sa Anti-Mage. That force field leads me to believe that Dyer just fortified their structure. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Oh, man! Well, another calling blade Dyer's from Saberlight. Tidak ada nangkita yon, pero itu nang kaya nang sabi ko, nasi Saberlight yang kailangan mag step up. And I think he's doing a lot of work after getting those skills and looking at the current net root. Tidak pade nang si Sumil, followed by Excess and then Saberlight. So si Mira kail, medio mahir ni boy nya sa ngayon. And I think he's gonna go for Midas pade. Mortimer's Kisses will be used by Sumail, will hit Fly and uh, huh, ayaw na tumama. And tumama na rin finally and Fly goes down. On the other side, we had the call and the Sun Strike. Calling Blade to finish up a Boca, but there's a lot of slow on the Saber Light. And Sumail with another kill. Dominating streak for Sumail and so right in 4k gold lead. Puts the travel is up for him and is going for uh, the status on his first item. So for Mane, still gonna go for that Battle Fury. Radiant's 
So I called from Saber Light onto Sumir, but do they have enough time to take him down? He had the cookies, Sumir is still alive, and now the disruption will be used. Boom onto Saber Light, and Sumir has the shield rune, so I think he'll be able to make it. But on the other side, they want to chase down the axe. Want to go for the bigger kill and exercise can he spot out Saber Light? Shadow Shama Bills, but Scorchard will be used. Makikita na nalagi si Saber Light. Think Tanker is available and naaabutan pa rin ba siya ng DPS? Well, mukhang di na yata siya aabutan doon ng DPS nung uh, Torch Earth. So, uh, TV from Sumail. Spots out the axe. We had the cookie for the stun and Scatter Blast. Not gonna be needed. So, mamatay pa rin naman doon si Saber Light. Top tower is under attack. Go for me. Radiant's middle tower is under attack! What need have I for this? Grabe yung entity? Ay, grabe ito yung entity tuloy. Sa live pala ni Polly yung comment na yun. Ano sabi na? Ay, sabi kay Golden for the Master and Manor is finally available for Miracle. Parang OG flashback talaga ito, yun ay yung call to sun strike. Well, more than more seasons will be dropped. Kid goes down and same goes for Mirahel. So yung boss 5 na naman yung napatay nila for this. So hindi naman worth it yung nangyaring dito for uh, Shopify. Now on the other side, Fly goes down as well. Saber Light with a call on to Bubuha. But can you take him down? And then you heal and then you untouchable. And now Sumail is already on the way. Has a TP and now Kuki will miss. But he had Aiden for the follow-up. They still had the control. Call will be used just to provide that extra armor. And we don't have any cancels onto the TP. So mabuboy pa rin naman si Saber Light. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Wait, no, hold on. But to mail with another kill, this time it's on to fly, it's just walking around the river. What's the matter with you? You just can even get a solo kill with just his right clicks. Hi, Kia. Eh, sa badili. Eh, guwapa ka ayaw mga kasi. Hindi po. Hindi po. Uh, 67 and 16 minutes and uh... So, ready at 10k gold in 4 team masters. Sobrang yaman lahat ng heroes nila. Yung Battle Fury is almost uh, up. Formally. And I think nyo na lang pala. Pinahirapan ko pa yung sarili ko.
Well, after you guys, the Battle Fury is gonna go for Mantis style, so back to usual item. And then time for the anti mage it's not gonna go for the Diffusal Blade, it ain't not needed. They have a lot of damage for the main. I wish I could command this type of saber like it's got. They have the Aethos and wala naman siyang kahit anong pang dispel nung the Aethos. Wala uh, siyang any defensive item. So that should be the kill onto a... Uh, onto Simon's cat. Money. Radiance middle. Now, Jamie, the for Team Master. You have a lot of skeletons for Revoca, so and then damage. Pero asan na ba yung mga kampanya? Pero stahi a lot. Pero dasan ang chances. So hindi pa rin yung attack ni Blue. Have the untouchable and heal, so Samira finally joins. Has the mi minus armor with that Zeus feather. So, um, maybe I'm going to talk to four heroes. But I'm going to do it. Well, as the main is going to take the Aegis. On the other side, and Gilagan Shahir, they're just pushing on this bottom tower. Still have his tier 1 tower down to half HP, pero hindi sila pwede masyado magpakita ng mapa. So they're just gonna use disruption. After they're already on the way to miss, time to look for a target. Someone to go with his Aethos, pero mukhang wala yata siyang maabutan. Or maybe crit. Have the vision, pero si Mil, he didn't have enough range. Well, Miracle gets caught, but he already has his BGB to dispel that aid does now call collects on the two use, but we have exercise waiting on the bottom side. Doom will be used on the Saber Light. And as the male is gonna be fine, still has that AG. So Saber Light goes down, same goes for Simon Scott, and they'll be able to take this stone stone on the high ground to easy gold gen for Baboka. Well, at least they managed to remove the ages on the uh on this na far pero problem is na commit naman sila dun ng BEB especially Mira Hell. Well, Tormentor for the side of Shopify Rebellion. Hindi ko nalang sila mamakuha na itong Tormentor. Mas better if they quit na magpupunta. And it will be given to... It will be given to fly. It's on to the undying. So, hold on reduction on the... Ah, never mind. Two stone seals na pala to. You gotta fortify them their structures. Good work. So, pwede nila itong pang save kung sino man yung mahuhuli with the Doom. But I think it's better if the Shard Upgrade is just the Shadow Demon. Is that the heal and the dispel? The lineup of Aster, yes! Radiant's bottom tower is under attack! 
Couldn't do much about Radiant's bottom tower, could you? Well, Doom will be used onto Mirachel and Kenny go for the safe call will be used onto Exercise and Mirachel will just walk away to mail his way too far to chase down this Invoker and Saberlight. Well, uh, it's gonna be fine. More and more skills will be used, but if he didn't have enough range, he'll mob. Mapupoy pa rin naman dito si Mirachel. So that's Doom down and now Saberlight goes in with the call, but it's just gonna hit Exercise. Doom so will be dropped and will be immediately taken down by Sumail and now Arhis is on the way with the Stone Gaze. Takes down Siamis Cat. That excess gets caught with the disruption. And but I ending Jenny still has the halberd. That we had the call again from Saber Light and Lasuro step for the side of Team Aster. Shadow Chill and Gabon and the Invoker. It gave time for uh, Shopify Rebellion to react. So imagine na kakuwa naman sila ng uh, gold kahit to final with two skills. Pero sa akin kasi free farm pa rin yung anti-mage. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. More gold never hurts. Well, missed call from Saber Light, but uh, Boboka, we had the damage from the Gaze Meteor. We still have the heal. Pike is on cooldown, and Monet is finally here. Blinks in, goes for Saber Light instead of Mirahel, and now the disarm is there. Another call from Saber, but this time doesn't have any mind. Boboka will finally go down. And Monet with the right clicks managed to take down this axe. And Mirahel, one more record for Monet will be enough as well. And that's a double kill for this anti mage. So, kanina na ako sila ng two kills. Mas bigger naman yung nakuha ngayon ng Aster. That's two for heroes dead. And they're not yet done chasing Abbott in the secret. They had the stun from the Kuki and that's heroes down. Meron pa tayong bonus gem dyan for Sumail. Now, another blink from Monet and that mana void on the dead line for heroes in exchange of one. And they're gonna take this tier 2 tower. Fortification is on cooldown for Shopify. Not my problem, but Dyer's top tower just fell. Oh, Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. So 15k gold lead for a uh, team master. I deserve this. Late ako, sino lamang sa mid? Si Sumail. <laughs> Dinurog ni Sumail si Miracle sa mid. Pero lamang din kasi talaga yung snap. Fire up against Invoker. Come on, sprites! Well, on the other side, Saber Light will be spotted out. They have the stun. Call will be there, but it's not going to do anything. And Saber Light still goes down. Now, on the other side, a Beastle Blade on the Mirror Hell. We had the Rags Harmony, but do they have any detection? Now, Excess goes in with the blink. To so, Mail, nasan yung gem? Kayo na may gem si Monet, pero wala silang detection sa ngayon. And uh, Mirror Hell, okay. No, wala yung gem, sir.
Oh, jeez, Radius Courier just got killed! Alexis says, guess it's done on to crit. Nakuha niya ba yung wisdom rune? Actually, wala pa kong wisdom rune. Nasa 28 pala labas. So, walang makukuha ang kahit ano yung secret po. Nung skill lang yun for Aser. You're gonna take that to your mentor and you Charlie played. So, we give in to the enchantress. So, ang dyan na yung little friends. Finals na ba to? What do you mean finals? Hindi pa. Ano pa lang to? Group stage. Group stage 1 pa lang to. Yung playoffs matagal pa. So smoke play for both sides and tignan natin kung sino bang unang magkakakitaan sa Miss Cat. We'll spot out fly drops sa sentry. Smoke will break now. I mean actually, smoke will expire. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack! When Mortimer sees it will be dropped by Sumail and Fly. We go down. Might she drop the tools only for time but on the other side, Fly, I mean uh... They brought with the call on to exercise, but it's way too tanky. Stone gaze from RTZ and mo ang tatali kud na lang dito yung mo team Aster. You need to wait out this stone gaze first. Now tornado will miss from Mirahel and mo ang game time now left for Aster. They still have Doom from exercise, pero divine labor na para dito si RTZ. He needs to be careful now. He goes in for the thing. Hands immediately onto the Doom and right is pero Medusa yung kailan yung tulong. Now he's gonna hide inside the Doom so pero Doom so will be out soon. Now RTZ is out. They have. The alacrity on to him, but he'll be able to survive. Ngayon ko na nakita na naka-divine na pa rin dito yung Medusa. That's Divine Napier and Butterfly. I think kakailanan yata ng MKB dito ng Anti-Mage. Well, kailangan mo niya mo naka-survive. Maybe he's gonna go for Halberd first just to disarm the Medusa. And then maybe later on, kailangan niya talaga ng MKB. You need to take this Divine Napier. Once na makunan dito yung Divine Napier on the Medusa. Oh, Radiant's top tower is under attack! Ayun na yung game. Oh boy, Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Oh, Radiant's top tower is under attack. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. A true Golden now. Oh, Radiant's top tower is under attack. Oh boy, Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Well, na pabis na ng Russian din for Shopify and that's AG's on to RTZ. So, um, wala na yung, wala na rin kasi talaga silang panlaban. So, parang all in na to for Shopify. Oh, Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Man, might as well save that energy because we're going to save her life. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Well, I don't. Oh boy, Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Dyer's middle tower just took a big beating. It's gone. Where are you going? Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Save me. So, then they go to the man for Team Aster, but RTC gets called Grand Abyss of Deed and that disarm. But on the other hand, the extra movement speed provided by the Solar Crest, we had a Demonic Lens to protect down the Medusa. We need to be EB, right? We need to be able to save the Tombstone save and then the Demonic Lens save. Oh man, this guy's dominating! Whoa, Mega Kill, uh-oh. 
Well, let's say it is down 4 on the side of Shopify Rebellion, pero RDZ is still fine. Ano pala naman yung Aegis and yung Divine? Yun yung kailangan nilang ingatan. Jeez, Morty, they're going after Tyre's bottom tower. Oh, mighty one. Pero alam mo yung problema dito for Shopify? Parang double-edged sword itong Divine Reaper. Can win out the game for you. Pero pag nalaglag to, parang auto-lose na dito yung Shopify. Sa mga wala na nabigla ng damage item dito yung Medusa. Only as Butterfly and Mantis fan. Other than that, wala na matitira sa kanya. So they still need to drag out this game, give more items on to RTZ. Invisibility. Oh, Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. And more than cases will be dropped by Sumail just trying to uh, clear out the creep wave. Oh, Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Oh, Radiant's middle tower is destroyed. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Come on, get, 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 get with it. Uh, and the five minutes more play for Shopify Rebellion. You're trying to look for someone. And the Wisdom Rune will be taken by Sumil. So top lane is being pushed out by the Enchanted Creep. We still have the Creep Wave from a Team Master. So mukhang wala naman yata silang mahuhuli with the smoke. So uh, okay lang naman dito yung Team Master. Aegis will expire in 40 seconds. Ang lakas na naman ng ulan. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Enemy call will be there from uh, Saber Light is on to exercise the hazard heads for the control. But can it take him down? Biggie will be popping stone gates already used by RTC. And now he needs to back away. Wala na tayo AG. He needs to play it safe even though wala Biggie view. Oh, yeah. oh, whoa. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Oh, great. Dyer's bottom tower just got destroyed. Nature attend us. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. What need have I for this? I think we're just waiting out another door and they need to play it safe for now. Well, uh, Aster, oh, they're going to push out your lanes. They need to fix their lanes, but they need to kill onto the axe. Together with XSS, they already used to do, but you have the Ocarine Core. Oh, Radiant's top tower is under attack. So, parang, andun na rin ba yung talent? Level 20 na ba siya? 
Yeah, and then there's your talent so sakit lang din naman yung cooldown ng Doom. Okay, ano na yung kay Golden for Team Aster and the game still hard for them kahit isipin sobrang taas talaga ng network lead. Yung meron sila. I mean, wala pa tayong answer on the Spotify on the Medusa. Wala pa tayong MKB for money. Pero once namakaw nyo na yung MKB, I think it's time for them to go. Mayan pa yung chantes sa Axe. Nakakuha din kasi siya ng Tormentor so parang magkasing yaman sila. Nakakuha pala siya ng Shard of Grade. Well, if I'm in smoke play for Shopify, it's a lot of play safe on your both sides. It's not going to happen, but Roshan will be up in 2 seconds and with the smoke. Time is cut. It looks like he's seen here with Miracle. He's waiting for the right moment to go for his cold snap hex. And they're playing it safe. Time is cut. Plants the ward. Has the vision. Now Axe will be spotted out. And Time is cut. He's playing around the trees. Drops his ultimate. Gets a slow on to the Axe. And we had the pushback. We had the first stab. Just to dodge out at EMP. So, we will be able to get Scat and we will be able to get the ward that they have here. But Roshan is finally up. This is the important thing for both sides. Team Aster, they need to contest this role if they want to pressure out Shopify. Good evening to Chester. Hello, welcome back. Wait up! So, uh, mukhang Shopify, Shopify, the mga Aster naman yata may ako no-rush or maybe not, we have the Tornado from Miracle will miss. Well, Aster, I mean, as the male will take the AG, Saga is blessing, not sure why you're not going to go, but Call will be there on to the enemy, but do they have a time to take him out? Panther style tried to go for the blink up, but we had the death blast to finish him off. And Monet has to go for the buyback. Stone Gaze will be used by the Medusa. We had to zoom on to him, but I think they're happy with that. They forced out the back. But a call from Saber Light connects on to SSS. But Sumail with the right list, they had the damage because they had the damage. And Saber Light, that impetus to finally finish him off. So he still has his buyback, but RTC needs to play. Save Ulana Shang BKB and Ulana Ring Shang Stone Gaze. Now SSS goes in, pops the BKB Monet. This will date on to Miracle. Has the Haber to uh, cancel out the click and a new right click from Sumail. Abutan pa dito si Miracle. And that's two buybacks committed for Shopify Rebellion. Meanwhile, XSS, I mean, uh, Simon is cat trying to hide under the trees. Has a force out to push back onto the low ground. And wala tayong pang cancel ng TP. Masyadong malayo si uh, Saber Light to go for that call on the cancel. So we still have. Aegis? Still have Aegis ba? Or actually, no, we don't have Aegis anymore. But that's a buyback committed by. The anti beach who um parehas na yata tayong walang buyback dito. Dami na kalimit. Actually, Miracle and Saber Light. May one more day for Aster. Pero ito na yung problema for Shopify. Nakukuha na ng Aster yung levels na kailangan nila for this game. Especially this snapfire. So, level 25. 
So, dyan yung little feather and dyan yung cream niya sa lahat at damage, shade of loose, blessed, silver edge. So, hindi lang yung AM yung problema niya. Kailangan din ang problema yung dito yung uh, Enchantress with the Impetus, little feather from the Snapfire. Well, Saber had with the miss call and now SSS goes in. They had the insect battle to mail with that little shadow. Miracle is very low, but they had the demonic lens and then you dispel and that heal. Miracle is going to be fine, but RTC finally pops his stone gaze. Not going to hit anyone with the stone farm, but so, I mean, uh, woke up with the chase, get the impact. So they had the call, Kali's date from, uh, never mind, it's the right clicks from RTC. So they did have a woke up, but Saber lights going to be a tie back for the axe and SSS is trying to look for more. Hatches fly and Miracle, that's a tie back for these two heroes and it's up to these three, up to the Medusa, Shadow Demon, and the Andai. Kung paano nila i defend yung high ground? Them their structures, good work. Oh boy, Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Huh. Dyer's middle tower, it's gone. Dyer's middle tower just took a big. So, mo ang rektahan na yan ato for Ashley. You need to go for this mega cliffs. You know, na walang buyback dito yung two heroes. Well, fortifications will be used. RTC, meron ba siyang any spells? Stone Gates will be up in 15 seconds. BKB as well. Just needs to wait out his items. Pero yung view for Tyre is already down. Any set of foes, RTC needs to go for that right click. Stone Gates still on cooldown. Pero Mane will pass down Fly. Fly still has his value. He's gonna go for it right now. And to mail for us lang dito si Ancient. And I just finally pops the stone gaze. Asa needs to turn their back up against this Medusa. He's trying to chase on Sumil. Gets a stone form and Sumil goes down. Still has that buyback and now zoom on to RTZ. We had to be so big for the control. And now it doesn't have any mana and that mana void. We're gonna take the game number one for uh, Team Master. Tumabot lang talaga tayo ng 45, almost 45 minutes because of that Divine Reaper on the Medusa. Pero simula pa lang, nakita mo naman na kung paano na win out ni Sumil yung lane niya. Same goes for the side lanes. Well, nice try pa rin naman for Shopify, pero yun nga lang, gaya nga sabi ko, Team Master, they have every answer up against Heroes so of Shopify, which is ayun yung wala sa kanila. Wala silang naging solid catch up against si Anti-Mage, up against si Mail. Wala silang Heroes na kayang tumalun on the backlines. Lahat sila nag stay behind the Medusa. And hindi naman pwedeng pumronto dito si RTC. The problem is you're up against Anti-Mage. Buti sana kung hindi siya na-counter na Anti-Mage, pwede siyang humarap. Pero sa game na ito kasi, Aster, they just had the better draft compared to Shopify Rebellion. But tignan natin what will happen for this game number 2. So, 5 to 10 minutes short break lang guys. And kita kita tayo for the next game.